U.S. political luminaries, including President Joe Biden and former President Barack Obama, came together Saturday to honor the life of former Senate Majority Leader Harry Reid in Nevada. Reid, who died last month at the age of 82 after battling pancreatic cancer, was described as an unpretentious pragmatist who got things done. And he was willing to cut deals, even with folks he didn't agree with or particularly like. Reid helped secure congressional passage of Obama's signature health care law in 2010 over sharp opposition from Republicans. And the former president said he could not have asked for a better friend. During my time in the Senate, he was more generous to me than I had any right to expect. He was one of the first people to encourage me to run for president, believing that despite my youth, despite my inexperience, despite the fact that I was African American, I could actually win, which at the time made one of us. President Biden, who served in the Senate for some 36 years, said Reid was one of the best majority leaders in history. He gave you his word. He kept it. You could bank on it. That's how he got so much done for the good of the country for so many decades. Obama, Biden, House Speaker Nancy Pelosi, and others described Reid's penchant for cutting conversations short and hanging up the phone without saying goodbye. I have to tell you, Every time I hear a dial tone, I think of Harry. You all think I'm kidding. Reed was first elected to the House in 1982 and was sent to the Senate by Nevada voters in 1986. He retired in 2016.